hello, hello. Shoo, everybody. It is a hot 66 degrees. Sunny, beautiful in Kentucky. Oh, I was going to change my earrings and put my earrings in that I just made. I am headed to the post office today. I have to mail a package to my aunt. Um, we save the tabs off of the cans. And uh, she apparently has some place that she donates them to. Um, Dad seems to think that she passes them out to people. I don't know. People do make things with them, um, but I don't know. So, um, it's Friday. Thank goodness. Big deal, really, for me. No different than any other day. It is getting nicer out, though, and um, that's a good thing. So what are you all going to do this weekend? I have to go home and work on my planner for my planner collab group. Um, attempt to make some jewelry. I need to buy some stamps while I'm here at the store. The store at the post office. Goodness. Well, not much has been going on. Mr. Sparkles from Soft Peak Stardust um, got to meet the neighbor and got cleared. He wasn't the one beating and banging on the door at 4.30 a.m. telling the dogs to shut up or whatever. So that's good. He got his name cleared. Clear Mr. Sparkles. Name clear, Mr. Sparkle. Or AKA Mr. Beardley. He doesn't like that name too well, Mr. Sparkle. I think that's perfect for a six foot man. Just saying, you know. You live in a soft pink, sparkly, glamour glittery and oh here comes a funeral possession uh -oh. those other people didn't have their lights on goofy butts sad and I got a call from my best friend um the one that um, I talk about that has the kidney transplants and uh, shingles in her shoulder. She may have to get her shoulder redone. Um, but um, there's some family things going on. Definitely need to keep her in your thoughts, her and her, your family. I'm not going to go into any more detail than that, but um, she needs some support right some strength and support. Um, and then all the other people that, you know, are nameless. I'm going to keep them nameless, whatever. Just keep them in your thoughts and in your prayers. <coughs> oh, and one I will name. Joanne Delbasso. Oh my gosh, today is April 15th. Oh my gosh, midnight is the deadline for the taxes been working her little fingers to the bone and working her brain. It's been smoking. She's been working, working, working. She's going to take a break after this. I'm telling you, she deserves one. She's going to get her a massage 
and a pedicure and a manicure and a spa day. Yep, she deserves one. Can't imagine. Oh, I was going to put some lips on before I started and I didn't do it. Dang on it. But anyway, they got some garage sales. Good thing I don't have any cash amongst myself. I think I need to stop by and get some coils from Adam at the Bluegrass Vape, so I'm gonna go there as well. And I totally missed my turn because I'm talking because I'm not going up that far in town today. Oh well, I could turn down this one road. I guess I'll do that. I'll try to head over there if I don't get lost because I don't go that way very often. I hope that you all have got some sunshine and then oh my goodness I tell you I don't I'm having to go through and um, hit my little bell on everybody's home page to get notifications for videos because I'm not getting I had them marked and I was getting notifications before but I'm not getting them now um, so I watched a, um, there's a whole group of friends I used to grow, I grew up with them, um, lost my train of thought, oh, uh, notifications, um, so anyway, I was, I missed a couple of Cheryl's videos, congratulations Cheryl. The stork came and visited, and she's got eight little puppies that she wasn't aware that was coming to town. Oh, gosh. And then she made a pretty dress out of a sheet that she found um, with a friend of hers when they went thrifting. Tie-dyed sheet. That was cute. Um, just a little comfortable cotton dress. That's what I'm all about, comfortable. I bought me a new t-shirt that I'm wearing, just took the tag off of, got it from Walmart for 89 or 87 or whatever. Um, the V-neck t-shirts. Um, they, uh, black of course, is my color. Uh, my closet is so full of black things um, because of when you work in the hair and the nail industry, um, most places that you work, um, you um, have to wear black. So I've come accustomed to wearing black a lot, which I like to wear black anyway, but um, when you've got a dog that's around that has white short hair, it's not a good thing, which that's E, just white, David's dog. Um, but anyway, I've tried to get color into my, which I do have the pink and the yellow and the blue, turquoise, teal, whatever, shirts. Trying to get some color in my, so I do have a little bit of color. But, of course, you know, I wear them every day, and I do know exactly why women wore aprons because when you're cooking especially if you're frying you get splatters and I forget and don't put any Dawn dish liquid on there or I don't have any shout or my mom was always the one to get the stuff out for me and she's not here anymore so guess what I'm going around with spotty clothes <laughs> Oh, Lucy, I sure do miss you. So many things that, you know, questions that come up that I should have thought to ask and write things down. That happens. Lisa Rose, guess what? I've got you in a new area today. This is not recognizable. She said that if she came to my house, she would be able to get to the store from my house. 
from watching my videos, which that's kind of scary in a way, but I don't know. I don't have anything for anybody to come get. Neither does my dad, really. We don't have anything. Just sentimental value stuff, that's all. <laughs> Mom wasn't big on jewelry or stuff like that, so, you know, what do you do? You just have sentimental things. Wow, there's a lot of traffic out today and people just flying by. And even when they've got a red light, I like to make sure that they're stopping. Oh, I cannot wait to go to this ENT. I'm telling you what, my ears are just, the left ear mainly is the biggest problem. Today, this right one's hurting a little bit, which I wouldn't actually say it was my neck. I mean, my ear, because it's the ear canal, I guess, that goes down into your throat or your neck or whatever. Oh, it's so pretty, it's so pretty, it's so pretty. We are heading into the town of Independence again, which I think I showed you all um, the drive one day. Our courthouse over here to the left. I don't know if you'll be able to see it or not. No, nope, I took it. No. Oh, well, duh, you're not looking forward to begin with. Stupid. It'll be here on the left in just a second. And there is the side of the building. And I really seriously need to turn on the air because it is just burning up. And of course, with black on, you know, that doesn't help. Watching Cheryl Coyote, um, I so enjoy her, 12 minutes, um, I so enjoy watching her on the porch in her front yard, and oh, what a beautiful area to just sit and relax and drama free, and excuse me, let me move you just a little bit there. Um, which I guess you can still see what's all around. Um, oh, I would just, you know, we've got that deck that you all like to see me film on. Um, man, we need some flowers and some vines to be growing up on there. So I'm going to see what I can do about that. Oh, 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 uh, er, your estate yard sale. OMG. Oh, I wish I had some money to spare. But anyway, I'm at the post office, so I'm going to be getting out here in just a second. And, um, I will be uh, back with you momentarily. Okay, I'm back. I had to turn my phone off at the post office because I had the wrong address. Because uh, because of 9-11, or 9-9-9-11, 9-1-1, they changed everybody's address. My cousin, I had to call him because I didn't have my aunt's number and you know, he didn't even know his mom, mom's address. So, um, I had to call her and I had the wrong address, so I had to go back in and redo my stuff. So, and it cost more than I thought. It was seven something. And I didn't think with, um, all I had in there was a scarf and two knee braces, which are flimsy from the Dollar Tree. Those uh, knee braces that you saw him haul on his Dollar Tree haul, which I should get him out and do something more. Um, and I'm burning up sweating my glasses. Under, my eyes are just sweat, soaking wet. Um, anyway, so 
sorry I was concentrating on the road. So anyway, it's a beautiful warm day. Now the temperature is, oh, 76. Wow. This thing must not have been right when I got in here. My goodness. Wow, yeah, this couldn't have been right when I got in. It hasn't gone up that much, and I haven't gone a while. But anyway, I went to Kroger's and picked up, oops, shaky, picked up a couple pizzas, and now my hair's going to get greasy, so I'm going to have to get in the shower later. Um, my, uh, Kroger's, I went to Kroger's, and, oh, goodness, they've changed everything in there. Why do they do that? They're rearranging the flipping store. So you can't flip and find anything. I went in there and I was going to look for photo paper. Why? I don't know. Um, why do I need it? Don't know. Um, but I was going to get a pack of it because I saw that they had a pack of it at Target online for like seven something. Or five. I think it was five something. So I thought, oh, well, I'll run in here because I'm not going to Florence. So I'll just run in here real quick, which it was online, so I don't know if it's different. Leave a comment below and let me know if you order anything from Target, if it's cheaper online than it is in the store or what. But anyway, it was 10 something in there. I forget how many sheets it had, and it wasn't the same brand, so I didn't get it because I didn't feel like spending $10. And then I went to the Bluegrass Vape, and um, his name's not and his name is Andrew, not Adam. I don't know why I keep calling him Adam. I guess he looks like an Adam to me, which he wasn't there. Kyle was there. Kyle's new. Nice to meet you, Kyle. Um, so, anyway, uh, he got me my coils, is what it's called. And I've got that um, getting some juice in it. So I can't smoke it yet because if you smoke it while it's dry, then it's not good it burns it up so that's a whole waste of a whole coil so you have to kind of like um, try to get the juice in the new coil so that's what I'm doing now and yes I am still smoking cigarettes some I've got to quit got to quit I've got to stop being so weak just saying the heck with it and um, start being real with this because you know so anyway yeah the box cost more than I thought and I stopped at Kroger's and got some pizzas and some more of that jar 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 burger cheese swiss cheese however you say it I'm gonna make me some more oh I should have got some rye bread dang it I guess I need to stop getting a loaf of rye bread somewhere. So family dollar. One more stop. Ooh, and then I could run in the Goodwill, which is a crappy Goodwill. So, um. I don't have money to spend. I don't know why I'm even thinking about this stop in places, but anyway, um, I need to get some rye bread or something for my cheese. Oh, maybe I'll just wait and get some because I can just put this cheese in there and not actually use it just yet. It'll keep in the fridge for a couple days. Love me some cheese, but I'm going to have to take something to help the old bowels because, whoo, getting stopped up. And I haven't been eating cheese. Oh, and then I, they had pretzels on sale, and they had um, Fritos on sale, and they had my Frito Lay, whatever cheddar, mild cheddar dip on sale. I used to get the jalapeno cheese and dip my pretzel rods in, but um, wow. I can't, and my tongue is too tender now, and I can't do that, and I really hate it, because man, I love me some of that cheese. Yes, 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 I do. So, I wonder, since Kyle's there, if Andrew, wonder what he's, 
working because I thought he said he worked all day and all, you know, like the whole day on Friday. Bummer, I hope it didn't mess up his pay. He doesn't lose some pay. Okay, we're passing up a family dollar. I don't need to go in there and spend any money. I don't need to spend any money. I need to go home and pay some more bills. Big dump trucks, wonder what they're up to. They're hauling dirt away from somewhere. Oh, and I've got to get that light. I just saw the UPS truck. I've got to print a label, but I don't have a sticky label. So is that going to make a difference to send back to Amazon? I can just tape it like on the box, right? I'm not too sure about this returning business stuff. I just now got the hang of... Aw. I just got the hang of um, mailing things. I just passed by. There was a young boy, maybe... 12, 14, out doing something, throwing something, and his grandma was sitting in the chair next to him. She was an elderly woman out sunning today. I'm going to try to get Ed out today. He got out and cut the grass yesterday afternoon. I don't know what he can do today. I need to find something for him to do. I need to, we need to buy some flowers some flowers going. Ugh, I need to start cleaning and getting rid of stuff in the basement, in the garage, and so forth. So anyway, um, we're at like eight minutes more, so this is going to be like a 30 minute flipping video. You quit doing that. I don't know. Y'all say you enjoy my car vlogs, so I don't know. But anyway, you need to go check out Cheryl Coyote, Soft Pink Stardust, Joanne Del Basso, or Joanne Plans. Um, let's see. Tracy B. Hi, Tracy. I saw her and her mom her video. her and Beth's cooking video yesterday. They were good. Um, they did a pasta type thing and um, so they looked good. So I added those to my playlist here on uh, my cooking playlist. I've got a cooking playlist that I have for recipes I'm going to try. Excuse me. It's going on 3 o'clock. It's that time of day where I just really have a hard time staying awake and these people got this trailer on the back of their vehicle you can still see their rear end but the lights aren't working on the trailer a lot of big dump trucks out here lately or what they're doing so back to um beth and liz beth graves corey sharer I don't know. I'm going to have to do a... Oh, oh, oh. Um, spoiler alert. Not a spoiler alert. Anyway, I was going to show you how to do my nails. How to dip acrylic. Do the acrylic dip. But, um, I have, am having lifting going on. Which means I'm getting it too close to my sidewalls and my cuticles. Because... Um, I'm having lifting because I can't see. So, um, I'm not going to be doing that video just yet because, wow, they got a paddle boat. Because I need to figure out how, where, and when I can um, do this. Because I can't see the clearness of the, because the glue that you or the resin that you put on your nail, which you polish on like polish, you brush it on like polish. Um, it 
uh, I can't see it so in the lighting that I have so I'm sorry I'm not going to be able to show you um, I attempted to do the video and I did um, this nail yesterday I'll put that finger up there um, but there's lifting so um, that's because I got it too close to the sidewall so we there will not be a nail video coming soon um, I'm gonna have to figure that out so have a wonderful weekend maybe I'll see you tomorrow if I get out gonna have to wash my hair now cuz I've been sweating all right, I love you guys. Thanks so much for stopping by. And hello to all my new subscribers. I'm at 569 now. Been there for a day or two. So give or take, whatever. So um, have a wonderful weekend. And um, remember to uh, spread a little sunshine. Thanks for stopping by. It's been great.